Hello everyone and welcome to this new video. Today we're going to prepare our new lineup. So our next opponents are going to be Porto Ferraio Rovers. And they sit here in the league. And they've been conceding 24 goals, which is even more than what we did. So this is good, I think. And then they've been scoring 11 goals which is the minimum that has been scored so far from oh sorry uh no yeah 24 goals conceded and um they have been scoring 11 goals total which which is the bare minimum uh, during this season uh, so far for i mean every possible uh, team so uh, let's have a look at what we can come up with in terms of lineup. But first, let's have a look at their lineup and see what we can understand from it. So, Porto Ferraio Rovers are here. 4.5 stars 19.1, 4.5 stars 27.6. These guys look dangerous. And then 4 stars 21.9, 4.5 stars 12.4, 4 stars 4.6 which means I think that this one guy is going to borrow experience from this one 48.7 4 stars 37 so he's going to borrow a lot of experience from the others I don't think it's going to be extremely high though uh, it's going to be around 12 or 13 points max so he's not going to reach 20 points and uh, 4 stars 4.6, 4.5 4 stars 40.4, very good defender, then 4 stars 27, goalkeeper, 4.5 4 stars 13.5. So I think we should be going with throw balls just like the opponents did, either with throw balls or with... Uh, short passing around the midfield because these guys don't really have uh, a very thick midfield I think so and these defenders well this one guy is very quick but we have very quick uh, strikers and wingers so this should be compensating yeah hopefully so let's try and go and have a look at our lineup as I said in yesterday's video, I'd like to play with Acosta this time around just to make our defence a little bit safer, hopefully. Then let's go this way, uh, Napoli Troiano. Well, these roles are fine, no, nothing's changed. Napoli Troiano, Veniero Ceriani is fine. Brianza Acosta, let's swap these two. Costa Brianza as a central midfielder. And there we are. So, goals scored. Well, yeah, in case we're winning by two, we'll go attacking only. I suppose they'll be playing on the wings, right? Yeah. Uh, should we be going attacking or not? No, we can't leave in the space. So let's go like this. We'll be attacking with throw balls and with balanced focus side, right? Yeah, anyway, Hildechuk is very good. He's very strong. Yeah, I think he's stronger than this one guy. Who's more than decent, actually, but in my opinion, not as good as not good enough to to stop Hilda check from doing his job so yeah I think that's the way we should be going or we might possibly be going defensive at the beginning because these guys have four stars on average well but the stamina is high so it doesn't make any sense we have lower stamina so we would be more tired than they would 
towards the end of the game. Yeah, these guys are have relatively high stamina. We don't, so we can't start and, and push very hard towards the end of the game, I'm afraid. So let's do it like this. And this time around, guys, hopefully with one more defending midfielder, we'll be able to, to take over the world. Uh, but actually, now that I think about it, yes, they have good strikers, but they've got basically no midfield. Why don't we play with Briant instead? Well, do you know what? I promise this is going to be our very last experiment from now on well from next game on will be serious very serious so Brianza Acosta and we'll do it this way so we'll be playing with three central midfielders hopefully the defense will be able to to withstand those very dangerous four strikers and if they do we'll be just taken over the midfield very badly uh, and uh, and outperform this one single guy over there uh, somewhat easily hopefully we'll be able to to do so so guys I think that was it for today's video um, I truly hope we'll be able to collect one victory because we definitely need it so uh, thank you again for watching and see you in the next video bye